Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi We are from Team KKSB College Community Sabak Bernal uh, As for our presentation We're going to present on our prototype But first um, This is the empathy map That we have come up uh, On our first day uh, This empathy map is filled uh, Based on the Outputs that we managed to Gathered from the interview session With our respondent uh, Cik Emilia Okay, uh, in this empathy map, <coughs> uh, the the um, the situation that was given to us was how do we ensure uh, our campus, uh, especially um, the canteen of our campus, is safe for all staff and students. So what do we have here are um, for this for this um, div uh, for this division Bahagiani, we have. Uh, always remind the students about social distan distancing and then share stories on vaccination experience or result in order for uh, uh, for the students to always remember uh, as a gentle reminder of uh, the following the SOPs and then um, what we can do is perhaps uh, people who do not have a dose are not allowed to enter the canteen and then for the hand, uh, for the hand, this, the hand symbol here, and the output that we have gathered are provide hand sanitizer upon entry, and then lead by examples by staff and also the lecturers. Uh, limit number of students at times. Put up posters around campus. Make the space spacious for distancing purpose. Okay, and then for um, the. Uh, thinking cloud this one we have limit number of students in the canteen and then um, use different hallway to sell food and then uh, put up announcement for SOP reminders check the temperature each of the students and also scan QR code before check in uh, this applies for all students and staff who wants to um, go to the canteen lastly on the heart shape um, section here we have encourage online check-ins show online statistics on COVID or vaccination details say thank you to the student who follow the SOP and lastly set targets for vaccination and zero COVID cases okay that is for our first uh, our first uh, frame. Moving on, new, moving on to our second frame. Uh, for the defined frame, okay, we have um, uh, under users profile, we have Aisha, 40, 40 years old. She is one of the staff in KKSB. Okay, she said that. Um, for the user's input based on the based on the um, interview um, maybe we can provide numbering system with duration at the canteen and uh, PPE requirement are provided okay and then under clustering we have uh, remind the students on the SOPs if they ignore the reminders the students or the staff are not allowed to be in that area ok that is our third frame the, our fourth frame is on um, idea shopping cart um, this is the brainstorming uh, output for our brainstorming session today we have uh, for team member number one uh, she said that she stated that uh, guard, guarding entry exit at the canteen to ensure that um, the uh, those that are go those that went there are at um, orderly in an orderly manner and then use numbering system at entry exit with limited number Okay, team member two said that, suggest that, um, make a pre-order a day before and staff collect at assigned time. Okay, after that, 
she also uh, suggests to limit number of students. Team member three suggests the students and the staff to order online and pick up on the go. The second one is reward, give reward for daily check-ins. Team member four, he suggests uh, that we assign different doors to add for entry and exit and schedule by department um, to use the canteen. Team member five suggests that we separate area between staff and students so that there won't be much crowd and also order online and pick up on the go. Okay, mo moving on on our second uh, frame on ideation. Okay, on the second round, um, we manage to choose, <coughs> manage to choose some of ideas, uh, and based on the ideas that we have chosen, um, the uh, we uh, we decided to go for online or order online and pick up on the go. Okay, this uh, suggestion was chosen by one, two, three, four. Sorry, one, two, three. One, two, three, and four mem members. Member one, member two, member three, and then member five chose the same suggestion. Hence, we decided to stick with this one and develop our prototype based on this suggestion. Order online and pick up on the go. Okay, in this, uh, in this, uh, regarding this suggestion, uh, we decide we uh, had brainstormed to come up with a prototype that meant that the students and the staff uh, could use to order the food online, and then they can pick up the food whenever convenient to them. Okay, moving on to our next frame on also ideation. Okay, on the our final round. Okay, so this is the suggestion I stated before. This is the suggestion that uh, we have chosen. Uh, we come up. We decided to create to come up with a system for our prototype. A system uh, where students and staff can uh, place an order and pay online as the payment method. Okay, they also can uh, do the self pickup. Um, so that we can control the movement and also control number of students and staff at the canteen. Uh, hence, um, to ensure that all staff and students can adhere to the SOPs uh, stated. Okay, here is our sketch on what the prototype. Uh, would look would look like okay here we have sketch um uh, it comes into a process where first they can the staff and the custom the staff and the students they can order their food first and then after that uh select the select the stall okay after they have select the stall they can browse through the menus okay before they browse through the menus and uh, they will be offered with four different stalls uh, according to, to what they wish to buy and then uh, under the store itself there will be a menu stated okay what the style what the stall sell and then they also need to key in the quantity for the food that they choose for the meal that they choose to buy after that they will be directed to the payment page whether using online banking uh, we highly encourage um, the students and the staff to do online banking, to make online banking transaction, uh, to minimize the risk of getting off spreading germs. After that, uh, they, the customers, the students and the staff, they get to choose their pick up hour, their pick up time um, and also pick up point uh, so that it would be more convenient for them to collect the food. Okay, and they don't have to they, and uh, so that not everybody has to go to the canteen to pick up the food so in this way we get to avoid having crowd or too many people 
at the canteen. Okay, and then at the end of the uh, at the end of the navigation, we will put on posters thank, saying thank you for uh, for using our service. Okay, um, we also going to uh, put out a note where there won't be any plastic given plastic bag given to them. This is to support the green technology, green movement initiative. Um, Alright, that is for uh, the brainstorming session from our jam board. The next part is uh, we're going to show you our prototype. Okay, we have come up with the prototype that we named as Food Order System College Community Sabak Bernam. In our prototype, we are going to use a google form in order for the students and the staff to order their food to place their order this is because um, the uh, the students and the staff are more familiar uh, with google form hence we try to uh, hence uh, it would be uh, easier for them to navigate the platform and also they do, uh, it is also easier for our part to uh, build the um, to build the platform if you can see here um, um, at the bottom of the poster we all have embedded the link of our google form next okay for the process when they fill in their google form okay they're gonna need to um, select their favorite stall Okay. Okay. In the uh, in selecting the favorite stall navigation, uh, there will be uh, they can see the all the four stalls um, available at our canteen. Uh, for example, we have the Abang stall and then Daniel Dessert stall, Akma Burger stall, and Yana Coffee Box. Each stall sells different food uh, for example for Akma burger stall um, this stall is selling is about is selling a western team food uh, they, where we can find uh, burgers or if they want some fries okay and then for uh, Yana coffee box she uh, this stall sells drinks uh, coffee based drinks Okay, and then next uh, we have a uh, Daniel dessert store where uh, this store sells a uh, uh, dessert type food. Okay, for example, um, this store sells cakes, ice cream, um, and other desserts. Okay, and then for the Abang store, uh, they provide food such as uh, nasi uh, chicken rice, uh, nasi kerabu, and also nasi lemak. So, uh, the uh, our canteen has a variety of food offered, and to be chosen from um, uh, for the students and also the staff. After they have selected uh, the food that they want to buy, they have to key in the uh, the quantity of the food that they want. Next. They will be directed to the payment uh, page where uh, they uh, where they can make an online transaction in order to pay for the food that they have um, ordered. Why do we choose to have online transaction for method payment for the payment? This is because we want to encourage um, the customers, the students, and the staff to. You to be cashless. Plus, the usage of cash also um, increase the risk of germ or spreading the germ. So we want to try to avoid that as much as possible. Alternatively, we still provide cash payment for those who uh, who for those who are unable to pay to pay by using online transaction. After that. 
the customers, the students and the staff, they get to pick the hour of the pickup and also they get to choose the pickup point. This to uh, make it easier and more convenient for the staff and the students. At the end of the navigation, uh, there will uh, the customer, the student, and the staff they will uh, they will be informed that uh, no plastic bag will be provided. Please provide their own bag. This is also to support the green uh, initiative movement. And that is all from our team. Thank you.